Five Rivers is the world's largest cattle feeder. It's made up of 11 feed yards in six states. Cooner Feed Yard is located just east of Kersey, Colorado on Highway 34, and we currently have a one-time feeding capacity of 100,000 head. So inside the gate here at Cooner, there's a lot that goes on every day. We'll bring in and ship out anywhere from 2,500 to 5,000 head a week on average throughout the year. In a year's time, we'll turn about 210,000 cattle through this feed yard. And when you break that down even further, you know, that's unloading anywhere from 30 to 40 semi loads of corn a day, producing three to three and a half million pounds of fresh feed. We have a cattle department who's responsible for receiving, arriving, processing, pinning those cattle. And then every single day, a pin rider and a vet tech are thoroughly going through those cattle, ensuring that their health and well being is to the highest standard that we can provide. BQA and animal welfare has always been the core of our business. It's the reason we're here. It's our sole responsibility from the day those cattle arrive to the day those cattle ship, make sure that they have the best environment possible. I'm in charge of the pin riders and the doctors who on the front line are handling the cattle, are making sure that they are healthy and you know, the well-being is taken care of. So in doing so, most importantly, we are giving these guys the right tools. So we're giving these guys trainings once a month making sure that they are good in whatever they're doing in relation to BQA. And then we're also performing quite a few um, in-house audits um, on a monthly basis, along with bringing in a third-party auditor. BQA has always been here at CUNER. I think doing what we're saying we're supposed to be doing just increases consumer confidence. Five Rivers is really an open book on what we do here every day. We host about 100 tours, about 1,000 people through this location every year. The biggest takeaway people have after touring our facility is typically how, quote unquote, happy the cattle are. I think that people are very pleasantly surprised at not only the quality of care, but the quality of life cattle have here. As someone who communicates with the public a lot about what goes on inside a feed yard, specifically this location, BQA is a great resource not only to give people guidelines for how we do everything every day, but let them know that there's kind of a higher authority that we're always answering to, that we're always improving on, that we're working toward. Guidelines that we can point to the public and kind of explain. There's a compassionate part of it, but there's also science behind why we want to handle and care for the cattle as well as possible. Low stress animal handling is, is the utmost importance here at Cuner. It's, it's what's best for the employees, it's what's best for the animal. Um, we have a lot of industry partners, relationships and friendships that has helped design this facility that's fairly new. This yard was completely renovated in, in the early 2000s. And so we lead on people like Temple Grandin to help design our process and facility to ensure low stress, easy flow through, through buildings. BQA and safe animal handling is important throughout the entire supply chain. As a feeder cattle buyer for a, for a yard this size, it's extremely important in our purchasing. I think that it's critical at the transportation level that the truck drivers are informed. BQAT is critical and really helps the cattle once they get here to be able to take off once they get on feed and really helps in terms of herd health. I feel that Cuner Feed Yard will be a progressive leader for the industry going forward just by the simple fact that, that we're never done educating ourselves, we're never done training our employees, finding better ways for our people to get their job done, finding a better environment for our cattle. We have compassion for animals and a passion for this industry and then we open our gates for full transparency. BQA is going to need to be um, a lot more largely accepted across the beef cattle industry. It's something that everyone needs to be on board with so that all ships rise.